your homemade biryani masala, follow these instructions. These are all the ingredients you would need. I've taken a little bit of uh, Ceylon cinnamon sticks. I've taken some fennel seeds. I've taken about five green cardamoms. I've taken about a teaspoon of coriander seeds. I've taken about three star anise and one and a half bay leaves. And I've taken about one mace, three to five cloves and uh, one uh, Marathi mokul, but it's also called as kapo buds. So we are going to dry roast these ingredients. You'll get a nice aroma when you start dry roasting them and you should dry roast them until they become slightly toasted, uh, slightly warm and uh... Now you have to dry roast these ingredients at low to medium flame and until they start giving a very beautiful aroma uh, you will also see that they slightly change their color into a beautiful greenish brown. You want your masalas to be roasted to that color and especially the bay leaf. Uh, you should be able to take the bay leaf and crumble it in the palm of your hand like so. I've transferred the contents into my mixer jar and I'm going to grind it into a coarsely ground masala. So this is your biryani masala. It should be of this color and almost this kind of granularity. Hope you can see it.